I thought my 18th year was when I learned a lot, but god damn. Hello YouTube, it's me, it's Erin, and welcome back to my channel, and on the day you're watching this, it's my 20th birthday! Woo! On February 17th, which is the day I'm uploading this video, I turned 20 years old, which is super exciting. I cannot believe I'm so old. I'm actually vlogging this weekend in my life, so stay tuned for Monday when I'm going to be uploading the weekend in my life. But last year, I actually uploaded an 18 things I learned 18 video, and I thought my 18th year was when I learned a lot, but god damn. Honestly, 19 taught me so much. I learned so many things, and I really just wanted to share them with you guys because I love these kinds of videos. So definitely give this video a like if you like videos like these. Definitely subscribe down below if you're new to my channel, and if you want to see the weekend of my life coming up or the other videos that I have. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday so I'd love for you to stick around and comment down below any things that you've learned or how old you are because I'd love to know because honestly a lot of my subscribers don't even know how old you are so let me know. But let's just get started. I have my laptop right here. I'm just going to be reading off of that. Number one, eating dairy isn't all it's cracked up to be. Cutting it out of your diet will clear up your skin and help you lose weight but eating a quesadilla or drinking a chocolate milkshake won't kill you. But chocolate almond milk will change your life and dairy-free Ben and Jerry's is so much better than the original. Number two, there's no place like home, but it's always important to take a risk every now and then, and if you don't love it, you can always come back. Number three, a teddy bear coat will fill the void in your life that you didn't even know existed. In fact, trying clothes that are a little bit out of your comfort zone, like statement coats and velvet pants, will make you feel like a rock star. Number four, just because you have the best intentions doesn't mean that everybody else will. Number five, I learned that I'm vitamin D deficient this year, so pretty much it's just an excuse to go on more vacations. Number six, I learned what it means to be a good friend and to surround yourself with people that are going to build you up and make you feel safe and loved. Number seven, vlogging is my absolute favorite thing, and if I could do it every single day, I probably would. Number eight, appreciate your family from all the times my dad would drive two hours to Newport when I was having a bad day or my mom would call me and we would talk on the phone for hours for all the support my cousins gave me, for all the love for my grandma and the Saturday sister dates that I have every week with Jamie. I became so much closer with my family this year and I'm honestly really grateful for that. Just because you can and want to eat an omelet and breakfast potatoes every single day doesn't mean that you should. <laughs> Number 10, being kind to people goes a long way. I try to remind myself that people won't always remember what you say to them, but they will remember how you make them feel. Number 11, I learned that sometimes the best friends of your life are right under your nose and you can't even see it. Number 12, journaling is important, reflection is necessary, and it's really cool to look back on myself and my thoughts and what I did and really just see how I've changed over the years. Number 13, I am 100% without a doubt a morning person and I'm tired of trying to hide it and I'm really now embracing it and finally accepting it. Number 14, working out clears my mind and keeps my body healthy and I feel more like myself when I do it consistently. Number 15, I learned that manifesting happiness is a real thing and if you tell yourself you're going to be okay, you will be. Number 16, no problem I have is as big of a deal as I think it is in the grand scheme of my life. Number 17, if someone shows you who they are, believe them the first time. Number 18, I learned that I am beautiful even if I don't have perfect winged eyeliner 24-7 or even if I'm in my sweats. And number 19, I learned that I love myself and I'm enough. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I know it was a little bit on the shorter side, but I love, love, love watching what people learned over the past years or people what they've just like collected in general. I felt like after I made the last video, I wasn't going to have enough in my mind that I was going to have change, but 19 taught me so much. I gained friends. I lost friends. I left the school. I changed my major. I went on vacations. I got new clothing pieces. I changed my hair. So many things changed about me, but inside, I'm still the same person, only an even more improved version of myself and I could not be happier with all the things that I learned when I was 19. Going through 19 was really difficult and a little bit hard for me because it was a little bit stressful and I learned so much and it was all hitting me at once. But overall I would not change anything that happened to me and I'm so grateful for everything and thank you guys so much for all the support you guys have given me over my 19th year. It means so much to me. So thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!